Hey everyone, it's Ollie Gorman at OG Golf and today we're going to be taking a look at these, the Nike Air Max 1G golf shoes. Now, in my opinion, there's one major factor that you should take into consideration before buying these. So let's take a look at what that is. So in terms of colorways, there are several options for you to choose from. We'll start with this one, as it's the one in my hands. Um, and this is just your standard black uh, with a little bit of gray. Um, other colorways include a white upper with a black accent, black trim, uh, a white upper with a blue trim. They also have a couple of options with a gray upper, uh, one of which has some red tones and accents to it, and then the other which has a what they call a lemon uh, Venom colour which is basically a fluorescent yellow colour. So these golf shoes were first released in 2020 and they came out at around £100. Since then the value of them has dropped slightly, you can get some good bargains out there and find them from anywhere around £60 to £80. And at that price point I do think they represent good value. One of the most noticeable features of this golf shoe is in the heel and it has the visible Nike Air Max uh, unit in the back there. Uh, this provides a lot of comfort, stability, a lot of cushion uh, when you walk and, and it feels great. So looking at the upper of the golf shoe, uh, first off I think it looks great, it's very stylish, very iconic, very much like the original trainer. Um, and one of the main benefits of this upper is that it's a mesh and is therefore very breathable. Uh, particularly in the summer, if it's very hot, this will come in very handy, keeping you cool, keeping you comfortable. So on the flip side of the breathability, um, because it's a mesh, this shoe is not waterproof. It is not suitable if it's raining. Now, because this is not waterproof, this is very much going to be a summer and summer only golf shoe. I was curious to how waterproof or how much protection it would provide. So I did take a jug of water and poured it over the golf shoe, but almost immediately my foot was soaking wet through. Um, so I definitely would not buy these if you're looking for a year-round golf shoe, um, but if you're specifically looking for a summer shoe, then yes, these will be very breathable and very comfortable. Now this is a very versatile golf shoe in terms of you can wear this very easily both on and off the course. I mean, just, just look at them. They, they look like a Nike trainer, Nike sneaker. They do not look like a golf shoe. Um, I've been wearing these going out and about uh, with my friends or doing errands, groceries, um, and they've been very comfortable and also they've looked great. Again though, if it was raining, I would not wear them. Now in terms of comfort and fit, I do find them extremely comfortable, but that's now. Um, when I first put them on, they felt rather narrow and tight over the toe area. I'm not sure if that's just me or not, but in my other night golf shoes, I have not had this problem and they were comfy straight off the bat. With these shoes, it almost as if I had to wear them in a little bit. Um, not, not very long, after a, a week of wearing them, just walking the dog and going out to groceries and playing a little bit of golf, uh, they were completely fine and now are extremely comfortable. But do bear that in mind that there's a chance they might not be comfortable straight off the bat. Looking at the sole of the golf shoe, they are a spikeless golf shoe. I have found that they do provide good traction, good grip. Uh, I've performed full bloody golf shots with my driver with these and I've not been falling or slipping or anything like that. Um, so the performance has been good. So overall, would I recommend this golf shoe? If you're looking for a versatile golf shoe that you can wear on and off the golf course, yes. If you're looking for a golf shoe you can wear all year round, absolutely not, I would not recommend it. Again, they are not waterproof. They don't have a waterproof warranty. Your feet will get wet if the course is wet, if it's raining. If you're looking specifically for a summer golf shoe, particularly now that the price has dropped a little bit, and again, you can get it around 60 to 80 pounds. I do think for a comfortable, stylish summer golf shoe, at 60 to 80 pounds, they do represent good value. So that's it, that's my review of the Nike Air 1 Max G Golf Shoe. Um, thank you very much for your time. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already. Again, I'm, I'm a little bit new to this uh, and it would 
your support would mean a lot to me. So enjoy your golf, and until next time, may all your drives be long. Where did you